Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 193. Briefly, describe spleen's anatomy. When talking about the anatomy of spleen, we will start off talking about the capsule. So here we see the capsule, the trabecula, we also see the vascular sinusoid, which is in the red pulp. Then we also see the white pulp, which consists of the follicle, marginal zone, and the periarterial lymphatic sheath, also known as PALS. A few additional notes is that the follicles contain the germinal center in which there are B cells. Red pulp contains the red blood cells. Periarterial lymphatic sheath contains T cells. And marginal zone has the antigen presenting cells. Now let's zoom in further and talk about the sinusoids of the spleen. What are the sinusoids of spleen? Sinusoids of spleen are long vascular channels in the red pulp with fenestrated barrel hoop basement membrane. And macrophages are located near this area. Where are the T cells found in the spleen? The T cells are found in the periarterial lymphatic sheath, also known as PALS, within the white pulp of the spleen. Where are the B cells found? The B cells are found in the follicles within the white pulp of the spleen. What is one of the functions of macrophages of the spleen? One of the functions of spleen's macrophages is to remove encapsulated bacteria. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.